Hey guys, I'm Pernell, that's Devin, we are Seven Tree Media, and on this episode, we are talking all about Facebook ads. How to uncover exactly what you need to know to quickly create highly converting Facebook ads that will help you predictably grow your business without gambling any more time or money, even if you're not super tech savvy. Now, what does it feel like to have this problem? It's very frustrating. You get frustrated because you're spending time and money on ads that you aren't getting any results from, which leads to overwhelming factors because there's so many options, tools, strategies, etc., that make you feel trapped because just when you seem to get it right, shit changes on you, man. <laughs> so how do we go about um, solving these issues? Or, you know what, give me an example. What do you think an example of this when people are getting too crazy for it? So uh, a huge example of this actually um, was a, a, uh, a financial group that we were working with um, very early this year. Right. Basically, what they were trying to do, they 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 uh, they specialize in insurance and stuff like that, and and helping people get their you know financial world in order, and and they were running ads that were basically just smiling faces, and mm -hmm. and it wasn't getting them any results. And when you're trying to distribute content in a meaningful way, um, especially uh, through Facebook ads, you really got to understand you know who your customer is. So mm -hmm. after sitting down with them and um, kind of putting them on that podcasting wagon, mm -hmm. they started creating content that was a little bit more suited to educating their clients before their clients came in. It was a little more, it was, it was a little more, um, adjusting towards this is the pain we felt now this is how we solved it it wasn't just happy smiling faces all the time exactly yeah so it spoke more to the customer themselves and mm -hmm. uh, when they ran those ads they were able to get a lot better results um, on on the feedback and the the, the leads that they were getting uh, they they ended up doing some um, we'll call them webinars they were more just like online seminars where they right. they take you through uh, the rest of the process after you kind of get the high level education they dig a little bit deeper with with you if you are interested. And this is the beautiful part about this kind of distribution is it acts <clears throat> as a funnel to bring the customers into that place where they're like, you know what? It sounds like this is exactly what I need. I'd like exactly. to take action on it, right? Exactly. Now, the reason people struggle with this problem is for three really simple reasons, guys. They're missing the fundamental principle of social media. Social you, media. Right. You want to be social. People want to interact with these things. If you're if you're doing those quick hit things, those, those straight to the point, just drive home the sale, it does not work for social media. Most people don't understand this. Um, the process they're doing is also missing some steps. Yeah. They're miss, we, we, I talk about this on every single episode, every single video we do, guys. You cannot miss steps. Every step is so critical to having this work for you, right? And again, one of the things they go for, they're, they want to see the shiny new thing, right? They, 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 they plan everything, they go head on at something, and then something new comes along. They want to try that instead. And they're missing fundamental key aspects of the plan, and they don't stick to it. Well, and that's the funny thing about marketing is, is that as somebody who's trying to market their own business, you get marketed to by other businesses right. at, who have the next shiny thing that's like, oh, you, your ads aren't going to work unless you have this thing. Mm -hmm. Your ads aren't going to work if you if, unless you run this thing. Right. If you're running Facebook ads, you need this thing. And so that shiny object syndrome makes it really easy to quickly take a detour and, and lose sight of what you're doing. Absolutely. Now, it's, it's really simple to solve these problems. It's yes. really simple to solve the frustration, right? You have to understand the three-pillar system, TM, TM, TM. It's because the three-pillar system takes you from not having any kind of influence on social media to being a powerhouse exactly where you want to be speaking directly to your customers, right? You get to control the content to build your audience. That's what this is based on, right? And then you get to pick your own platform and you dominate that platform, yeah. right? You cannot stretch, you, you can stretch yourself over all these different social media platforms, but if you can target one that you know 100% in depth, all the different aspects of it, you are much, much, have a, you have a greater chance of succeeding than if you just, if you were to spread yourself so thin. Yeah, it addresses that shiny object syndrome. If you stay focused on that one platform and you get the system figured out, once you have that, you can take that somewhere else. And that's the beauty of it. So understand that at the top level, you're trying to reach people on a platform, whatever that platform is. It used to be newspapers, mm -hmm. magazines, radio, television, flyers in the mail, that kind of mm -hmm. stuff. Um, but now it's shifted. Now everything's online. So it's the top 10 different um, social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, you know, Snapchat, all that kind of stuff. So once you know that platform and then you can have the right conversations with people because they don't, we don't want to see ads when we're on these places, when we're on yeah. these platforms. The same principle applies when you're watching TV. Mm -hmm. Guess what? PVR ruined the advertising industry. You, If you're watching TV and you don't like the ad that you're watching, you can quickly fast forward through it and you're on to the next thing. So people don't want to see that. They want to see content. And if you can get them there, you hack the system. You break the system because now you can have those uh, conversations with people in a meaningful way and then contextually target
get the right people with the right offers and, and actually um, inspire action from those people. Exactly. Guys, listen, one of the greatest pieces of, uh, of advice that I've ever heard, I guess I guess one of the greatest statements I've ever heard is that if you if you if you advertise while I'm watching my show, I instantly hate your product. <laughs> if your ad cuts in, and let's let's talk YouTube. If you're not using YouTube Red, right? Mm -hmm. If you're on YouTube, you're in the middle of a 20 minute or half an hour video, and you get an advertisement right in the middle, it automatically makes me want to hate your thing, your your product. Yeah. There, there's so many ways to hit these um to hit these audiences without actually getting into their bad zone. Does that make sense? It's worth $14 a month to me not to be advertised to. Absolutely, right? That's why Netflix works so well. That's why Crave works well. Hulu, all these things work very well because their subscription models are not actually ad-based models. So there's certain ways to get into that as well, guys. And all of that, all of that can be worked out within your plan. <clears throat> Give me the outro. All right, listen. What we're explaining to you right now, the distribution portion of this running Facebook ads, that's one small piece of a, of a bigger system that we've kind of uncovered. We've battle tested out there with real businesses who are local serving and who are big, depending on what it is that you're looking for. But um, this 3X growth map is what we call it, combines a sustainable content model with the three pillar system so that you can two or three times your inbound leads in 90 days or less without the stress of gambling your time or money, trying to figure it all out. And this works even if if you've never been successful in the past or you're not tech savvy or you don't know what you're doing when it comes to this kind of thing, it's exactly all those little pieces of the puzzle, the shiny objects that you keep seeing, this takes all of the right ones and puts it into a box for you and we've created a free resource for you. It's a downloadable PDF and an eight minute training video for you to kind of break down and understand the system in a little bit more depth. So somewhere around this piece of content, there's gonna be a link, click that link, go over there, get that resource and, and just see how you can start to apply this inside of your business and I, I promise you, you're gonna have that light bulb moment. It's just gonna all open up for you. You're gonna be able to understand exactly the process that you need to follow to uh, increase those qualified inbound leads in a very short period of time, even if you don't know anything about it and you don't have to stress gambling your time or money. So grab that and, and you know what, if that's not enough, we are for a very limited time giving away uh, free 15 minute, no cost to you uh, strategy calls where we'll uh, sit down with you and we'll just kind of diagnose what exactly, where the breakdowns are occurring inside of your marketing plan so that you, you can um, take what we're doing here and, and put it out there. And it's not just what works for us and our businesses and the people that we serve. This is what every successful business is using to uh, increase those qualified inbound leads. So if that's something you're looking for, take advantage of it. The link is somewhere around here.